What's up everybody, this is Dallas Stone here and in today, in this video, I'm going to be teaching you about custom pivot points, uh, specifically custom axes, pivot points for two edges or faces. Now, what is so cool about this kind of feature, um, I'm going to show you. So sometimes you're going to have something like an object in your scene and you're rotating it and changing it and moving it and it's got like really weird rotations and, and coordinates. And then all of a sudden you you freeze transform it. Right, hold on. All of a sudden you freeze transform it. You kill the history, and you have an item that's kind of in this weird state. And you can't go to object or component here because there's nothing in terms of those. So you can't go to world, object, or component because again, everything has been reset. Everything has been frozen. So for example, let's say you want to now move this object along this face's axis. So we're gonna select the entire, all, all the faces. We're gonna go to hold W. We're gonna go to axes. We're gonna go to custom. We're gonna go to set to face. And now we're gonna select this face. And now you're gonna notice that the gizmo here for the transform has now changed and it's now set along this face and this is super handy because now you, you can move it and it's going to be a lot more accurate if that is your intention right so likewise over here if you wanted to move it along this ax this face's axis or this edge even what you can do is you can hold w again press the left click button go to axes go to custom go to edges instead this time and it's aligning itself along this edge kind of move it down that way um and again i'm, I'm going to show you the face one axis custom set the face move it up here and again it's it's bringing its pivot and aligning it to the axes of that face so hopefully that helps out a lot of people and um see you all again next time bye now